we have the uh, Whistler CR97, and uh, it's picking up some uh, collision avoidance systems, and with this uh, new FDSR mode for the field disturbance sensor rejection, which is what these uh, systems are actually called technically, you can see that it detects it. Uh, you can sometimes see different bands, but instead of other radar detectors just giving you different frequencies, uh, this will actually show you the data uh, that comes up when it detects it uh, with numbers and it automatically mutes it, which is pretty cool. The other thing I like about the CR97, which is unique, if you uh, manually mute it when you're detecting these things or you're around them for a period of time on a highway, uh, it will stay muted uh, for the entire duration, regardless of what signals it's uh, seeing uh, with the data, unlike other detectors, which may alert briefly and then not alert. So if you mute them and then they stop alerting, they will uh, alert again. So it's like you have to keep pushing the mute button. This will actually mute for the entire duration that you're uh, in the proximity of these systems and detecting them. And uh, for a little bit after the time it doesn't detect it, it'll still stay muted. So if it gets reacquired or you pick up another one in a crowded highway, uh, It'll, it'll stay muted, so it makes it much, much more pleasant uh, when it detects those systems. Plus, it, this, is have, uh, this detector has a very configurable timing uh, configurations, uh, including uh, hundreds of a millisecond that you can basically change thereabouts in, in a step of plus uh, even TFSR, uh, which you know, should give a sufficient amount of time to get reject most of these systems. But, uh, Configure it very, very configurable. There we go again. We're picking up another one. So the, you know, the other thing is when you have detectors with traffic flow sensor uh, filters, uh, it can make the detector potentially blind to other legitimate radar. Uh, and at least with the Whistler, it lets you know that uh, it's being interfered with and that your detections may be affected as well. So, very nice feature of the Whistler CR97 and unique to it. So, uh, there you have it.